Hello everybody, it's me. Welcome, welcome back to Nier, where today I am somewhat sleepy because I definitely slept in all of last night, this morning. Uh, either way, the point is I was not a good robot about my sleep schedule. But that's in the past now, let's play some Nier. Man, the white really, like, covers up my little ear thingies. Headphones? I don't know. Either way, we're, we're jumping in because we are, we are post-time skip. We are, we are big boy near now. And, uh, we are, I think it was going to go visit Popola? That sounds right. Right, no, Popola, and now we're going to go visit Emil. Emil... And we have, uh, the, the big swords now. The very big swords. I don't know how effective they'll prove to be, but I suppose we'll find out. Let's get that mouse cursor off screen. Ah, now the quests pop up. Hello. Hey, you haven't seen any thieves. The thieves. Don't take a lot. Okay. Maybe, well, I just... Do you have a plan? Let's try out the thieves in the village. Can't I see. Thieves. One could call it a sign of the times. Rare is the man who steals out of choice as opposed to need. Ah, uh, you're not wrong. Ah, just... What's up? Yeah, water wheel. All right. This is a wise thought on your part. That wheel is a machine of... No I suppose we'd all be. Replacing the axle and the paddle... Strange thing in facade. All right. All right. Alright, so we're headed to Facade for that. We're gonna ask around the village. Are you a thief? We've been dealing with a wave of robberies lately. Better keep a close eye on your purse. Ooh. I hear it's two thieves working as a team. So I definitely have coffee right now, I will say that. It's a, it's a certain mood. Alright. Two thieves working as a team. Hey, Devola, how you doing? Hmm, what have we got today? Which job should I give you first? Oh. Got a job from Seafront if you aren't... I wrote down the... Oh. Which job should I give you first? Want to go to Seafront? I've got... I... Oh. Which job should I give Oh, I have to pick first? one? Okay. Never mind. A shipbuilder in Sea... Can't I take them all? Which job should I... Sounds like someone's got... I wrote down... What's this? Yep, here. That's... That was the right one. Okay, I would like to take all the jobs, but apparently not, because Yoko Taro is still laughing at me. A robbery? Hmm. Come to think of it, I did catch a glimpse of a pint-sized fellow moving suspiciously through the shadows. Maybe he was involved? Gasp! Pint-sized? What we found, we're dealing with two thieves. Most likely a couple of kids. Remember the pair of brothers that loiter near the water wheel? I fear they may be hiding something from us. I actually don't, but okay. So have us a little chat. I'll take your word for it, Vice. Water wheel, that'd be this way, right? And then, like, around right the corner here? Nope. Hang on. How the heck do I get to the water wheel? I've never really gone to this part. Okay, yeah, there are... Oh, God. Hang on, I gotta... How the hell do I get over there? Oh, I gotta go up and over? Really? Alright, whatever. If you say so, game. It seems like a really inconvenient route to get to a water wheel. Like, surely there's just a back door to one of these buildings. Alright. Fess up. Are you two the ones behind the recent robberies? You must already know if you're asking like that. Your tone betrays your guilt. Confess. Confess now, lest the rage of Grimoire Vice fall upon you. Okay, we 
did it. My brother and me. Why? Because Dad told us to. Your own father demanded that you steal. This guy sounds like a real piece of work. Where is he now? Probably in the tavern. That's where he spends all his time. Got it. Alright. We're gonna fuck up a father. Hooray! Question mark. Hey, you have a pair of sons? Huh? What? Was it to you, huh? Why you gotta ask me all these questions? You're forcing your own kids to commit crimes? Crimes? No, no, it's, it's not like that. I just... I just told him to go find some food for the family. Now shut your mouth before I... Before I shut it for you. Bunch of no good meddlers. Uh, our time is wasted on this drunken scoundrel. What a sad excuse for a father. How shall we explain this to the client? We'll tell him the truth. Then we'll figure out what to do with the kids. Uh, yeah, let's find some food while I get drunk. Did you find the culprit? Yeah, but it's complicated. A pair of children driven to steal by an abusive father? Well, I certainly didn't expect this. They shouldn't have stolen from you, but I don't think they're entirely at fault here. Agreed. I'll talk to the other shopkeepers and make sure they understand. Thanks. Oh, and I also think we should get them away from their father. Not sure who could take them. Folks are barely getting by as it is. But let me spread the word and see what we can figure out. Ah, yes, your fee. Well, us shop owners passed the hat and came up with this. I hope it's enough. Using children as tools of thievery. Unthinkable. I can't believe this happened in our village. Things are more desperate than I knew. If we hope to restore the lives of the villagers, we must cull as many shades as we can. Yeah. Yep, that's the one true answer. Murder. That is how we shall save the world. Probably. Maybe? Uh, give me Dark Lance. Give me old reliable. Oh. We'll find you, Yona. We'll find Shadow Lord. We'll make him give vice that big. That's a lot of shades. Holy shit. Pahu! Weapons attack pal plus 10. Hell yeah. And that is why we murdered some shades. We may be slow, but we kind of kick their asses right now. It's actually viable to just slap them to death, finally, rather than do the instant kill. God resistance plus 12! Alright. Let's put some of those on, especially the uh, weapon. On Kusanagi, we don't have anything on this. Pahu! And I guess we'll stick with Mahes. What was it? Martial Arts? Uh, for... Gardens. Yeah, whatever. We'll leave it as it is for now. We can figure it out later. We're not in like a super tense level as far as strength right now. We can keep fighting. Ha ha! That's the big sword for you. Spin! The fun part is, because it's a two-handed sword, wildly swinging and flailing is basically how you're intended to use the thing. Like, that's... The, the, you, get, you get up into the, the army of spearmen, you walk up to them, and you start swinging and don't stop. Ain't nobody gonna wanna fuck with that. Berserkers are basically the uh, warrior equivalent of I don't know where I am, I don't know why I'm here, all I know is that I must kill.
Oh, we're just fucking them up. I don't even know how much XP this is getting me, but it feels worth it. Or at the very least, it feels satisfying. But we got a meal to visit. A meal. Welcome, sirs. Master Emil is waiting in his chambers. Let's go! Where's best boy? Show me best boy. There he is. He has not aged a day. Hey, Emil. It's been a while. And, uh, you haven't aged a day. See, this is why I named the main character Ferris. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm sort of special that way. Huh. Fair enough. Anyway, I hear you found a lead on undoing the petrification curse. Yes. Take a look at this. Following the recent incident with number six, we have decided to establish an archival room. This room will hold records on the methods used to control and or cancel all forms of magic, including petrification and bestial transformation. As well as allow other product projects to move forward. Specifically, this should make it easier to complete a long-term storage solution for number six, as well as proceed with our work on number seven. All employees are required to keep the courtyard entrance to this new room secure, Failure to do so is considered grounds for immediate termination. There's a section of this manor called the planning room, and I think... I see. I think this room will let you harness the ability to control all forms of magic, correct? Actually, yeah. Or even if it doesn't, something there might point us in the right direction. So where is this planning room? There's an entrance in the courtyard. It's not far. Good. Let's go find it. Let's go! The Mellow Companion, Emil, has joined your party! Hooray! This room truly contains the power to control all magic. I can use it to cure my eyes. If we could heal both Emil and Kaine at once, it would be quite an achievement. Two birds with one, um, stone, as they say. Wow, Vice. I didn't think you cared. Perhaps this tome is getting a bit sappy in his old mm. age. The paintings are back to normal. Interesting. I wonder what I, I guess the butler fixed them up. Right around here somewhere. Maybe it was just the um the shades playing the silly prank. Oh shit. At least we can still go in here. This facility... I can't read the rest. Something about a seal? Arf, arf. If someone bothered to attach a warning to this room, I doubt they will appreciate us forcing our way inside. Uh, Emil, you okay? What's wrong? Nothing. It's nothing. I'm fine. I'm sure he's alright. What could possibly go wrong? Something is amiss with Emil. Take care not to stray too far from him. Oh yeah. Um. So, welcome to this part of the video. Right. In case you weren't sure about the time skip, um, fucking with the different gameplay styles. Welcome to. They literally just turned it isometric. Like, HARD isometric. I don't even know how they did this shit. It is kind of impressive, I'll be honest with you. I didn't think you could do this sort of thing with, like, rotating it. But they found a way. I know, I know what specific shit they did to make it work, but they made it work. Emil continues to be OP, must nerf. It's nerf or nothing. He, he seems like the sort of guy who'd use a nerf gun. Happy chaos ass motherfucker. AA, KA, 
Bidet, Lali Lule. I don't even know what specific game this is referencing. Like, it feels like Shadowrun, if anything, but that's just because that's the most recent, like, game with this sort of style of isometric in my brain. I'll be honest, when we ain't even killing these before a meal gets to them. As I said, meal kinda OP. Uh-huh. Again? Don't know why I'm bothering. He can insta-kill these things. Uh, how'd I miss that? And it's gone now anyway. Alright, whatever. There was a green dot there, apparently. Yeah, so, you know this shit was intentional, the... Like, you can only see it at a specific angle. Like... Like, um... Ah, there it is. Two-handed sword fanging the twins! It is stronger. More of an axe, but whatever. Yeah, I, I got it. It's fine. Where is he? There you are, buddy. Jesus, that's a lot of dudes. Okay, hold hold the fuck up. Jesus Christ, where did you all come from? Ula, armor break. Neat. Continue to murder. There we go. Once they're all knocked down, it's a little less deadly. I heal! Attack power plus 15%! God damn. These words are getting better and better. Hang the twins. I heal! Did that go on magic? No. Oh. It did, but it doesn't work. Okay. Yeah, I, I got it, Vice. He's right there. Settle down. And once again, he takes them all out. Because of course he does. He's a meal. He is best boy, by default. What does that make uh, older near? Best male, clearly. I should probably use my magic more, huh? There we go. Uh. Oh my god, yeah, I get it, Vice. Gebel yeah, magic power plus 15%. That's the good shit. Gebel, yeah, baby. Let's go. What's this? A scrap of paper. Came the new document. We've completed the initial research into number six and are ready to initiate the startup experiment in the coming days. As this will likely mark a great leap forward in Gestalt research, the National Weapons Research Laboratory has made the completion of number six project its top priority. Budgets for all other projects are to be frozen effective immediately. And there's a certain mask down below. Hmm. Interesting. 
By the way, this does count as a further Resident Evil reference. Mia. Just saying. It a hundred percent counts. Jesus, it's a lot. Hang on, we. I gotta swap out this magic. Hold up. Lance is not the magic of choice right now. Give me, give me, uh, rotating blades and an execution right here today. And let's put words on those. Gebel and Gebel. Yeah, maybe having the right magic is going to be helpful here. Because now this can, like, deal extra DPS. Yeah, that was a good call. We are, we are pure tanky mode right now, is what we are. And again? Jeez, this is a lot of dudes. What the fuck? Oh, I can make them go away. Cute. Oh my god, there's more. Doesn't really do more damage, does it? I think I want to just stick with the DPS side of it. And the immobilizing side of execution. Especially since it's hard to aim. But I suppose they went so hard in this section specifically because you have a meal with you. And he's he's there to uh to fuck some shit up. There we go. Let's go. Alright, hello. I'm gonna fuck y'all up. Honestly, I might as well just do the instant kill on ya. There we go. Alright, more amazing. Yeah, I got ya, I got your vice. I don't know why vice is so picky about this, but he is. Yeah, wow, I'm just gonna leave that shit up. Means that um, all the Emil ones insta die and hang on to you to fuck. And if I could see them attacking, the parry would be OP right now. But I cannot, for it is blinding. Aha! Yeah, okay. One, two, three. I'm just gonna spam block. Honestly, when they're when they're swarming me like that. Then maybe not. At least I keep getting medicinal herbs off of them. That's kinda nice. Yo, a metal bat! That was a rare one. I don't know what it's good for, but I got it. Oh hello. Alright. Moving on. I am very low on healing items right now. God damn it. Can't see in there. There we go. There we go. Moving on. And here we have... More of you fuckers, alright. Ah. 
Put them up. Not great. Not great. Okay, let's try that again. That was perhaps a little bit on the bad side. I'm gonna bring back Dark Lance. If I can because execution's just not doing it for me. Alright. Uh anyway, give me Lance, and then you be whirlwind. But then I can just do that. And then Emil can just do that. Okay. If it works. And you fuckers. You get Donk, donk. Donk. And there they go. I don't know why Lance specifically can go through that shield, but it can. Hey, Dagda. I can definitely understand you film that one. Given context. Including sudden freezes. Oof. Not a great start for that game. Acha! There we go. It's an armor piercer. I'm fair point on the lance, but yeah. Anyways. Welcome. Yeah, we're in. So, Dagda, I was trying to figure this out earlier. What would you say this is a reference to? Because I could only compare it to, like, Shadowrun in my head. I couldn't think of another isometric game. But I know there, there's definitely one where it's like, yeah, this is just that game. I mean, the, the, the lab under a mansion is still Resident Evil. Gauntlet? Oh, shit, you're right. Yep, that, that's it. It's Gauntlet. Yep, that, that, that is entirely on the money. Oh my god, Vice! He's coming, alright? Jesus. We're clearing the way. Settle down. God damn. Oh, fuck me. Ah. Stab. I was having fun, like, just swinging my, my weapon wildly, but at this point, I kind of need to conserve my healing items. I may have gone a little ham. Oh. Not a word. Mahia! Item drop rate 12. We're putting that on. Certainly something that was influenced by Gauntlet and Danny. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Mahia! Mahila, Mahila. I don't know what that is. On the weapons! Because it's Pahil Mahira. Stab. Ah! Stab. Oh, God damn it, more of them! Stab. 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 God damn it. Emil, that was my kill. Hey, what's this element for popular game Turk and top shout out for Aeon? Oh. I mean. That's not a bad thing. Also, to be fair, there are there are several of those where I'm the one who can answer it. You're not alone, you're just like slightly more knowledgeable on some of these things. Whereas there are some where I'm I'm more of a answer. Boomer knowledge, basically. Whereas I can be like, oh shit, that was a reference to something from the PS2 era or the like. Because that's that's where that's what I grew up with was slightly beyond that. Though at this point, 
you ask the fucking Zuma, and they're like, oh my god, the PS2's a retro console, and I die a little inside. You know how it is. God damn it. Oh my god, the PS3 is so old. Oh my god, the Nintendo Wii? Oh, that's like a grandpa console. I'm like, you're, you're right and wrong in equal measure. Remember that time Nintendo s thought, yes, this is clearly our target audience. Old people in nursing homes and shit. Why do I not have any healing? Emil, I'm gonna need you to, like, go hard right now. I'm gonna die in here. Remember that video where there's some dude holding up? Remember this gem, the enemies? Mamma Mia, you're not old. Yeah. Mario Kart DS is old now. Uh, I mean, the same could be said for du the Double Dash is technically older. Just doesn't feel the same because it's not on the DS. And GameCube nostalgia is still strong. Oh, how I'm going to fucking die in here. Thank Christ. Mill, can you go for the one that I'm not about to instant kill? Yeah, like that. Double Dash is your favorite? I... I'm very much in the DS camp, but that's because it's the one I grew up on. I do have a soft spot for the Mario Kart 64. I don't know. Something about that one hits different. Oh my god, Vice, shut up! I, I get it, Yoko Taro's doing a funny. Didn't drop any, okay. No. Get the fucking... There. Sheesh. We was very janky. Oh my god. We is like peak jank, but the wet it we was definitely the best iteration for motorcycles. Or, like you, you can't deny that. Herb. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use the defense drop. Uh spirit drop, actually. And I should've used the defense drop. Well, that was the right case for a magical drop. I'm very fucked right now. Ah, and I'm dead, okay. Well, that's to be expected. Ain't it. How far back does it put me? Let's find out. Oh, Jesus Christ. I should leave and get more medicinal herbs. Clearly what this was influ influenced by was Smash TV, right? Big money! Big prizes! I love it! Editor's note, Emil does not love it. Emil is in fact having a very bad time right now. Get away from me! Jesus. There we go. 
Gotcha. All right. Uh, let's clear these out real quick. Neil can get all of you. Oh, I thought he could. Or he could just stand there menacingly. Excellent. Ma. Um, Baha Blast? I don't know. And down you go. Excellent. Alright. Uh, defense drop. There you are. Ah! Bitch. Ah, fuck. Ah, not good. Okay, when you does the overhead, that does... There we go, my guard break, nice. Having an attack I need to dodge by jumping in this... It's not fun. Yo, God damn it, your car. Okay, at least I can do more damage to these things now with my new weapon. Come on, what the fuck was that? There we go. Var, That'll do. And more of these guys are gonna spawn in over here. Because this is where you go to hide. And your guitar is doing a funny again. Why, Vice, would you shut the fuck up? And there go my herbs. Yeah, it figures they go my herbs. Alright, whatever. Vice, shut the fuck up! I get it. Yoko Taro is having a laugh. It's a solution for the long term storage of number six, a progress report on number seven, disguising the laboratory's above ground facility as a mansion. Get it? Because Resident Evil. So this was some sort of weapons laboratory. What the hell was going on down here? <sighs> what was I doing here? I have doubts as to whether or not Emil will be able to continue. I... I'm fine. Let's just go. Let's go! Uh... Let's go! Why does this look familiar? I'm concerned, because this looks like the top floor. Oh god, more of you fuckers. Gotcha. Oh, I, you need to stay on the floor. There. God damn it. Oh, goody! Spawn in, I don't have the resources for Martial arts, physical strength plus 12%. I'll take that. But I'm probably gonna lose it because I'm about to fucking die. Bessel. Bessel. Uh, I need to swap you out for the perma stun. Just keep fucking. What the fuck is this hallway? What the fuck just happened? What the shit was that? It just- they, they just all barreled into a hallway. Oh my god, this fucking game. 
Does it, did it keep my words? Uh, nope. Who cares? Email. Vi, shut the fuck up! Alright, no medicinal herbs, thanks, Hirokotara. I don't care that he probably didn't touch that part, I'm blaming him. And there's Basal, I'll get that later. Where's my level up? I should have one by now. Oh, get the fucking thing. Get in the fucking robot, Shinji. Alright. Now for the fun part! We just sit here and spam this, and stun lock them all to death. I was meant to get blood out of that one, Emil! Give me the defense drop. I might make you survive if I accidentally get slapped in here. Oh god, I heard. Thank Christ. Alright. Stab you. And end with you. Okay, we got it. Jesus Christ, that was a thing. Vice, shut up, holy crap. You can't leave and you'll be up. Oh my god. There we go. Huh. Elephant slides. Alright. Okay, here we go. And thus the fun begins. Side note. Uh, disclaimer, fun is relative. It is fun for the shades. For you, it is terrifying, because you are running low on resources. And there's still more to come. Oh god. The fucking mages. Defense. Drop again. Uh, get him. Get the big fuck. Get the small fuck. Out of healing, get the magic fuck. I can't act like I'd be doing parries and shit, but I can't fucking see. It's so- they're so small. Oh god! He did that on purpose. He knew exactly what he was fucking doing. Emil, I'm gonna need you to delete these fuckers. Where'd Emil go? I, I don't know where Emil went. Definitely in trouble though. Got one. I I genuinely don't know where Emil is right now. And I'm dead. Ugh. All right. Let's try that again. This is one of those things where this is the hardest part of the game. It feels like it could be entirely true right now. All right. Just gonna keep magicking right now. Good job, Emil. You keep at it. 
Oh, with your instant kill powers. There we go. Gotta get you fuckers. Primarily. Wow, I didn't get any of those. That was mean. Best part is the lock on barely works in here. As does the dodge! I think that got the magic. Oh, I got a magic drop off of you as well. So that's right. Gotcha! Another herb. Okay. Time for the fun! Alright, that's why I had the defense drop. Now you stay down so I can insta kill you. Ah, you bitch. Right, that's all I was about to get that. There! Come on. when the game just locks you into attack animations that you can't see because I'm so small on the screen right now. And then I repeat, Yoko Taro is laughing his ass off at every single bit of pain. He's like, haha, yeah, it is hard to see. Holy shit. The donor body Halua has been chosen from among the seven candidate subjects to proceed to the next stage. In the interest of protecting state secrets, all but one of the remaining subjects will be disposed of. The donor body Emil, however, will be kept in storage as a failsafe measure. I'm sure it's fine. You sure you're okay, Emil? I'm a weapon. What does that even mean? What am I? It appears he's trying to remember something. You're gonna be fine. Am I? Am I really? Your past makes no difference. We'll support you no matter what. At any rate, you would hardly be the first member of our merry band to have issues. He's not wrong. Naming the kinase. Alright, I'm gonna take a half second to go get a drink. Everyone else hydrate. I have acquired liquid. I'm nearing the end of the Metal Gear franchise now, clearly. Clearly, I've turned into Revolver Ocelot. Let's go. Would you look at that?
remember now. I remember everything. We used to be humans. Normal humans. Just a bunch of regular human kids like you'd see anywhere. And then, we came here. They wanted to turn us into weapons. So they used magic to perform terrible experiments on us. Eventually they succeeded. They managed to create a perfect weapon. The name of that weapon was Number Six. But soon they lost control of Number Six, and the experiment was deemed a failure. They had to create a weapon that could petrify Number Six and seal it away. So they created me. I'm Number Seven. I'm... I'm a weapon. Weapon or no weapon, you're still a meal to us. Thank you. Aww. This is number six. She's... my sister. <coughs> this thing is alive? My sister is the greatest weapon ever made, and... Yes, go on. And with her power, I could eradicate my petrification curse. So what's the plan here? First, you have to promise me something. If my sister somehow manages to swallow me up... If my original self becomes lost... I'm afraid I may try to hurt all of you. And if that happens... No! Wait! Then I want you to kill me. You have to get him out of there, now! I'm on it. Let's go! Number six. And Emil? This thing's weak. Let's open this back out. Give me back Blast, baby. Gabil. My hero. Too quick! Oh yeah, by the way, uh, welcome to uh, You Can't Destroy the Bullets Anymore. At least not all of them. Magic is the only way to damage this one. Yep. Ain't nothing else. To it. Then let's kill that thing with magic and get Emil out of there! Let's swap out one thing. On magic. Let's! Instead of that. Where is it? MP costs minus 8%. Again, in case you are uncertain about the bullet hell. Yeah, I'm gonna 
swap out that one too. Hang on. Magic, Blast, Lugka. Magic damage. Yeah, I don't have anything that increases MP recovery. That'd be perfect right about now. I want to hold off because I'm. I feel like he's about to do something, but. Maybe I just gotta keep at this. Okay, here we go. Speaking of bullet hell. That'll do it. Five, six, nope, five. Let's harm the boy. We must use magic to defend this beast. Break these and get. I can. All right, that should be doing that, huh? I guess that'll speed it up if I actually do it properly. Go. Four, five, six. Seven, eight. Wow, well, I'm out of healing items, huh? That's not a good spot to be right now. Yep, not a good spot to be. What I need. I'm just trying to break these things. It's something that hits fast. But no, nope, that's not fast enough, apparently. I'm probably gonna die. Yep. Okay. I'm gonna try that again, and this time, um, actually make use of the magic drops. Because if I was making use of those, I actually would have won that fight. So let's try that again. Three, four, five, Hurry. six, There's still time seven. to save him. I know there is. I'm gonna do the word edits. Hang on. Ah, Lugka. Lugka. Magic is the only way to damage this one. That's different. Four, five. Way too quick. Look at how slow this thing's moving. I'm just fucking up is what's happening here. Three, four. There we go. Three, five, six, seven, eight.
Hey. I just realized I'm an idiot. I should have this equipped. Seven. And you drop. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Any different? He is highly resistant to it. Then let's kill that thing with magic and get Emil out of there. Mario Kart chat, basically. Well, I'm just sitting here wishing I had a healing item so I could do this boss fight faster. Otherwise, we're kind of stuffed. Is basically where we're at right now. Ah, damn it! Yeah. Alright, and again, this time really wishing I'd bought more items. Alright, twice, word edit, magic, Logaz to Lugka, Mahira to Lugka, weapons, Earthworm's Claw. Can't do much there. I'll leave it at that. This one, uh, I'm gonna play. Uh, uh, whatever. Can't do much about that. Martial arts, defend. Uh, nothing there. Here. Magic defense. Conera. Okay. It's all Panera. All right, let's see how this goes. Five, six, still time to seven, eight. I... No, there is. Magic is the only way to damage this one. I forget what the efficient mana regen is here, but... Probably about that much. Okay. Better get some sleep, huh? That's all right, Dagda. Thanks for tuning in. And I, it, it really does suck when your internet's fucked, don't it? Come on. Halfway. All right, phase two. What's up, bitch? I'm Spider-Man. Alright. Oh, 
that's all right. Yeah, I want to be able to see where I'm dodging here. Cha 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 cha. Maybe I should have been doing this for a while now. One, two, three. Ha cha 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 cha! Two, three. Ba ba ba! There he goes. Oh, Jesus Christ! What the fuck is this? Number six having a moment here. Emil, we're coming for you. Come back to us. Emil's in there somewhere. Gotta help the boy. He's a boy. better not great not great don't fuck this up now come on so close Get that fucker there we go dodge them hit you about to fall off. Get him! Alright, here comes the wave of chaos. One, two, three, four, five. Come on. Almost got him. That'll do. Uh, or not. Ah, hell, it's gonna be like that, isn't it? Okay. Alright. We might be fucked. God damn it. This is a fight. Four, five. I'll be ready to burst it when I'm about to kill him. Ooh, that was close. I nearly fucked that one up. Alright. Watch all them. Walk on to you. Ha cha 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 cha. Yes, again. Alright. Six, seven, eight. Alright. That's gonna happen, that's fine. We're just gonna let this play out a little bit. Cause I wanna be at max mana for what happens next. At least close to it. There we go. Yeah, it's definitely gonna take more than one go. Alright, one more round. Don't fuck this up now, Ferris. Okay. 
No. Three, four, five, six, seven. No, nope, six. I'll take it. I'll also take that. I fucked that slightly, but that's alright. At least I didn't get hit. Ha cha cha cha! Hey, you. Come on. Three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, he falls down. That's good, actually. Right now, right in this moment, that's a good thing. There we go. You can just unload in him like this, and he will fall over. There it goes. It should do it. There it is! That's for Drakengard 1's final boss fight. Emil. 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 Halua. Emil, wake up. Halua. It's okay. It's over now. I'll always be watching over you, Emil. Thank you, Halua. Emil! Yeah? Are you alright? I'm still alive! I feel my sister's power inside me! I think I can control my abilities now! Yes, we're all quite pleased. Now get out here already! Just a second. I can't... I can't see very well. Ugh. No! Don't! Don't look at me! Neil, what's wrong? Stay back! Good God. <laughs> Welcome back, Emil. You've been through a lot. But my... My body... I can't stand to be with you when I look like this. What I tell you, we're here for you, no matter what. <laughs> This is how I look now, then so be it. I was terrified at first, but it's not all bad, you know? I have the magic I wanted, 
And I can use it to bring Kaine back to us. Emil. We should hurry. She's waiting. I sure hope seeing me doesn't petrify her. You know, in fear? I see this transformation has not stolen your terrible sense of humor. He's Skelly Boy. And that is why Emil is best boy, because he turned into a skeleton and we love him. We love him and adore him and he is best boy. Whenever I interacted with Kaine, I was reminded about something from my past. Maybe my mind has been confusing her with my sister this whole time. Anyway... And if you ever looked at that mask and thought, wow, that's a goofy design. It seems kind of silly and over the top and uncanny. Yeah. But he's still a meal. That's okay. <clears throat> beast approaches. We do have a problem, however. Incoming. And I am low on resources. And been in there for five goddamn years. I think I might be a little pissed. Let's make a point, shall we? What five years can do to a person. This creature must have. How did it even survive these past five years? I'm not gonna let this happen again. It dies today. This sword fits lighter. It's not the blade, but the skill of the user. Strike it down. This thing ain't standing a chance. Before we were relying on Vice's magic to make up the difference. Now? Now we are the difference. One regen. Barely. It ain't got nothing. It is, however, definitely angrier. I'll give it that. Ah. And however, it's still gonna die all the same. I don't care how much regeneration you got. You won't survive this. Goddamn water balloon. Alive. alive. Stay alive. Stay alive. Grandma. Kaine, you gotta live. You gotta come back to us. You were the one. 
time calling me, weren't you? You still recognize me? Of course. I knew you right away. Thank you, Kaine. Welcome back, Kaine. Wow, you grew up. So, how long has it been? Five years. <laughs> that is a face of sploosh. Just saying. I don't really blame her. Shit. That's a long time. Any luck with Yona? We are still no closer to finding her. We need a way to locate the Shadow Lord. By the way, this is for you. Is that a lunar tear? It's not as good as your grandmother's, but I tried. No, it's great. Thank you. Kaine waking from her long petrified sleep. Meals unflagging kindness. Our reunion was a happy one, and we let it wash over us like rain. That is, until Devola and Popola had to go and ruin it all. Are you kidding me? You can't be serious! Please, try to understand. People are tired and scared, and... I'm sorry. I'm sorry you have to bear the brunt of that. This is crap, and you know it! It's okay. We can sleep outside. No one's sleeping outside. You and Kaine saved this village, and now they want to run you out? People are afraid of us. And really, I understand. I mean, look at me. As long as you're still with us, I can deal with it. Right, Kaine? I'm used to sleeping outside. But... We'll see you later. Sorry about this. What is the matter? Kaine always sleeps outside. I never thought about that until just now. Never even occurred to me. Damn it. We should turn in. I didn't get much sleep that night. For the first time in my life, I hated Devola. For the first time in my life, I doubted Popola. But those feelings are pointless in the end. They said and did what they did for the sake of the village. Protect it from the horror of the shades. <laughs> really, how can I blame Devola and Popola? In the end, I'm just as bad. Because I never once stopped to think about Kaine and Emil's situation myself. May God have mercy on us all. Project Gestalt's ultimate success. Alright. Sleep well? Sure. And yet your red eyes tell a different tale. Don't be so hard on yourself, lad. I need to go see Devola and Popola. Very well. That's Kaine back. I even got an achievement for it. No, uh, still not allowed in, are they? Devola? Hey. Oh, uh, hi. I kinda thought you'd never talk to us again. I understand you're doing this for the village, and that you don't have a choice. Pretty much, yeah. But look, 
Why don't you go talk to Popola? I think she wanted to discuss the Shadow Lord with you. I'm headed there next. Oh, and Devola? Yeah? Sorry about yesterday. I shouldn't have lost my temper like that. You don't need to apologize. Anyone would be upset when their friends are hurting. Let Emil and Kaine know that we're sorry, all right? All right. All right. So that's Emil saved. Kaine saved. Now we can turn our eyes back to the Shadow Lord. Don't you give Wavice a big sloppy kiss, Shadow Lord? Anyway. Kaine's meme-worthy uh, rant aside. Popola? Oh. Hello. Look, I want to apologize for yes- Stop. You didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, but neither did you. You meant sa you mean save Yona, right? Well, yeah, the murdering the Shadow Lord and saving Yona are kind of hand in hand. You're just trying to protect the villagers, and I jumped down your throat for it. It's very kind of you to say so. Regardless, please don't let it trouble you. Ahem. <clears throat> I believe there was something you wished to discuss with us. Oh, right. Yes, about that. You know about the Lost Shrine, right? The temple where I was first discovered. That's it. Well, it seems that the Shadow Lord's lair is connected to it somehow. Oh, oh. It was right under our pages the whole time. But the bridge that leads there is unusable. So, take a boat. A, a boat? Yes. The canal's finally been repaired. Of course it is, Gas, of course. It took a lot longer than expected. What with the shades and all. I also asked them to provide a boat at the path to the Lost Shrine's back entrance. The ferryman will let you use it free of charge. That should make it easier for you to move from town to town. Thanks, Popola. I feel like you've done so much for me. I'm really grateful. <sighs> All right. I'll see you around. And for the love of everything, be careful. Alrighty, we have a ferry now. It can take us... a uh, question mark. It's... The path above the entrance to the shopping district should lead to the boat landing. Uh, oh, excellent oh. to know the canal is finished. Hopefully this puts our days of running all over behind us. The faster we can move, the faster we can save Yona. Let's use it as often as we need. But Vice, what about the boar drifting? We still need to... <laughs> boar drift off. Inertial boar, etc., etc. Hello there. Oh, it's you! Hey, look who it is! Oh Remember God, it's me? you! That red bag. I, my pages. You're the slovenly half of that couple who refused to stop arguing. Hey, it's been a while. Sure has. I've been in charge of this canal since we last talked. Apparently, I did a pretty good job with it because they decided to make me the permanent ferryman. Oh, yeah, huh? Congrats. Thanks. Still, it's not all puppies and unicorns. The old ball and chain is always harping on me now about how much I work. Anyway, if you got a place to be, just let me know and I'll take you there. You can head to Seafront, the Desert, the Northern Plains, and the Lost Shrine. We have a side quest in Seafront. Let's go knock that out real quick. Alright. Speaking of side quests and seafront. Oh, it's you. I've heard yeah. yeah. Oh, no need. I'm... I need you to retrieve the Import this cargo. Like uh, uh, collect the thorn. Let's go. No. I was shipping some Hey, it's your money. Did you see that huge ship? Yep. That's right. She was shipping bad dragon products, and that's why we can't open them. Don't worry. They paid extra for the um blank uh box thing. You know the one. Anyway. 
Uh, where the heck are we going? I don't... Oh, wait, no. No, where are we going? The Farish, you've been working on your Lunar Tear farm, right? Yep, definitely. Definitely not gonna be playing through the game on my own time to get all the bloody oh, weapons. Okay. Oh my god, you're still on about the sardines? It's been five years! Do I even still have that quest? Oh my god, I do. Oh, whatever. Let's go to the Lost Shrine. Let's... we can... we can save the detours for another stream. And who... boy am I definitely pulling up a guide for where to get all the weapons on those. Listen, I got all the endings in every single other Nier and Drakengard oh, game except for two. I don't need to do this one as well. Three achievements for getting platinum before you just quit. That sounds about right. And this wasn't like Automata where you could just buy them. The Lost Shrine's up ahead. Just past this cave. Oh, it's this place. As well as the Shadow Lord's castle. Shadow Lord. Just make haste. You can find this big sloppy kiss, Shadow Lord. There it is. The back door. Kaini's favorite. What? And I'm so disappointed they changed the flavor of the... It's an Aussie slash New Zealand energy drink. And they made it smoother and fruitier. Except V was tasty because it was sour and tangy. So they kind of fucked it up. Emil, you don't need to show off that you can fly, alright? Lunatia, get 500k gold. Spear Devil Queen. And beat the game in four hours. Yeah, that sounds about right. This was definitely the era of, like, mindless tedium achievements. But, uh, the... Uh, for some reason, they sort of took off with the Xbox. I... I, I don't know. Gamer score, apparently. I, I don't go, I never really got it. Got it. Like, I get wanting to up the score, but it's so arbitrary. Like, people would buy games because there was an easy thousand gamer score, and it's like, what? Doesn't that defeat the purpose? But whatever. Anyways, we're back! This place is looking a lot less collapsed than it used to be, huh? I don't really know how that happened, but... Oh, hello. Oh, they're the weapon... the... the... Sh the shielded types. I love the music. I mean, it's pretty freaking great. That's absolutely fair. The music's fucking phenomenal. See? I can parry you now because I'm not playing in isometric mode. Stab. Stab. Wow, that didn't kill you. Damn, you strong. Stab. There we go. I totally forgot to buy medicinal herbs. Oh well. YOLO. Ah. Mate, you know... 
Maybe we shouldn't. Maybe we should learn our lesson and go back and buy some things. Let's. I'm gonna. I'm gonna make the strangest decision of my life and do the smart thing and go back and buy supplies. I can't believe this is happening, but it's happening. Who am I and what have I done with Ferris? I should just be able to jump down, right? Yeah, see? Easy. See? It didn't even take that long. Alright. Oh my goodness, what am I doing? Alright, alright. Ferryman, 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 ferryman. Take me home so I may buy things. I demand it. I get a village is just my village. So I founded the fucking thing. Everywhere else has a name. Facade, seafront. Not my village, though. That's just my village. It's mine now. I own it. Give me all your things. I worked it out. Alright. Alright, uh, uh, herb. Eight. I don't really have the money for the other bits. Shop here more. But having more herb is important. Uh, I don't think I can even do much with defense drop. This is what I was talking about. But herb important, so we herb. We herba. Herbal. Gibble? Gibble! Garchomp! Oh, Pokemon! Anyways, back we go. Just ignore that random detour of me forgetting the resupply. Alrighty. And I did not get enough sleep last night. Or I did, but it didn't work properly. I, I listen. I, I don't know. I don't know how sleep works, and at this point I'm too afraid to ask. Thank you, Emil. I didn't realize you had healing powers. But apparently you do. Hooray! Oh. May as well. Do the fishing rods count as weapons? I could see that being the case in a Yoko Taro game, I'm just saying. I don't think it is, but I could see it being so. Alright, we're back, we're back. We barely lost any time. Back to the Lost Shrine, back to the murder. yippee ki Mr. Falcon. Uh, find me in the Alps. I'm gonna fuck you up. Your, your life ends in the next five minutes. Or I could fucking miss. God damn it. Vice, learn to aim. No, you can't blame that on me. It's an auto lock system. My FCS needs upgrading. Ah! Really? You're gonna be like that, are ya? Head. Hmm. Looks like you uh, need to get a heads up. And yeah, you sure are head of the game. You're missing your head and other such puns. Seven, eight. 
Acha, cha, 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 cha. Really? Come on now. Maybe I should have gone and upgraded my weapons. I'm pretty sure we're going there after this, so like, why go there early? What I need to do is level up. Ulo! Armor break plus eight. And the strength capsule. Nice. Keep rolling. Alrighty. Uh, one thing I haven't asked, how are you all doing today, chat? We've cut- I've kind of just- I won't lie, most of today has been me letting the game speak because it's going, like, extra hard on the story, music, like, everything's been going extra with the actual game itself. So I've sort of been wanting to let it have the spotlight today. But now we're actually just back in the, the regular combat so I can think again. And I've been having a good time. I put out the worlds down for the moment because I realized I was starting to get sick of the, um, just the game loop in that game was, I don't know. I, I, I think the sheer amount of pointless loot was starting to get to me. How the fuck did I do this one? Hang on. I gotta, like, nope. Hang on. How the fuck am I? What do you want me to do here, game? Like that, and then like that, and like that, so this can go like that, okay. Yeah, also still been playing through Armored Core, which has been a good amount of fun, this is all especially in New Game Plus weapons. But God damn, do you have a lot of fun when you have the full arsenal available. Not that there was anything wrong with the basics. Like, if I'm being honest, when it comes to something like Armored Core, the basic boring weapons are often the most, like, actually effective. But that's also not really what that sort of game is about, is it? If you wanted to play optimally, like, you could always Google how to build a mech. Like, you had to do some stupid shit. And just look cool while doing it. Fuck you! How do you block that? Stab. <laughs> I've also started playing Medieval. Um, that is the PlayStation game. Because for, for all the series never having taken off, so Daniel Fortescue is the greatest hero of the entire Sony library. Um, and I will die on that hill. That, listen, we set, we stand Sir Daniel Fortescue around here. And we will not tolerate any nonsense or, or, or snide remarks to his glorious heroic name. Remember, he was at the very forefront of the charge against the evil wizard. Yep. Now see, this is all... This is, this is the sort of joke that only makes sense if you know what the fuck I'm talking about. Which most people who haven't played Medieval will not. Also, we're playing Sokoban, by the way. Just want to point that out. Oh, what the fuck is this? Also, I see that. Hey! <laughs> Um, yeah, there. Pull you down. Pull you across. And down again. That was easier than the last room. There we go. Oh, 
I don't even know if I'm going the right way. I kind of just kept wandering into rooms. Ah! Okay, that wasn't great. Nice one, Kaide. At least when these guys fall down, they don't get up very well. And he's dead. As am I! Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Son of a bitch knocked me back to the start. God damn it! Uh. Alright. The hell am I on about? I don't know anymore. I will say now, I am looking forward to Cyberpunk releasing soon. I'm pretty sure we can finish up near, if not in time for that. At least get close enough that I can, like, be finishing Nier and starting Cyberpunk at the same time. Um, and I fully, I believe I can run it. I'm not certain. And we're gonna have to do, like, a test stream to make sure. But, I should be able to stream Cyberpunk. It would, um... It would take some nonsense for me to not be able to, like on par with the Armored Core nonsense. But the thing is, I sort of, especially after all the optimization patches and that, I have faith that Cyberpunk is going to be a touch more stable than Armored Core was. And if so, well, we can enter Night City together and see what's what. And if not, well, at least we'll know. And I'll play that on my own time. I do know that if... So I can say this. If Cyberpunk... I should turn the music down a touch. If Cyberpunk doesn't work, uh, we'll be playing Fallout 2. I can tell you that right now. Um, I've had Fallout on the brain lately, so... That sort of sitting as, if we can't cyberpunk, we are going to fall out. Uh, let me gebble gebu. Wait, no, this is already stronger, never mind. Gotcha! Gotcha. Gotcha, bitch. Gotcha, bitch. Oh, you're not dead. Well, there you will be. Huzzah! Alrighty. What's going on in here? Oh boy, more weaklings! Let's murder them en masse. Look at them die. Oh, goodness. It's Friday night all over again. One of these days, someone's gonna make a compilation of all my Friday night comments. It's gonna, it's gonna turn out I have, I, oh, my Fridays are fucking packed and wild. Uh, oh my god, really? Alright. Yes, yes, Sokoban, I get it. Very cute. Really? Alright. Uh, I guess in there, and then I guess over right there. Then you go over there. Maybe I should just play Sokoban on stream. Like, like the original one. Like, find whatever the first tangible release of Sokoban is, and just stream that for a bit. Oh, hello. Itch you fellas again. Ah, god damn it. Yes, I'm gonna need you to fall over. You didn't fall over. Why didn't you fall over? You did. Aha! Stab. There we go. Now we're getting it. Now we get someone with this whole thing. Stab. Ah, 
Dab. Jesus, that's a lot of dudes. Okay, hold up. There we go. And stab you again. Oh, you can get stabbed as well. Hooray! Thank you, Kaine. You've allowed me to stab. We kind of fucking annihilated them, holy crap. Yeah, yeah, I don't know that you're gonna have a good time here, mate. I, in fact, I think you might be fucked, son. Stab. Ah. Let's not get totally screwed over here. There we go. And again. And they're all gonna die now. Oh wow, you got up in time. Look at you knowing how to stand up. That means you get stabbed the manual way. Aren't you proud of yourself? Oh fuck me. Not you again! How many times are you gonna show up? Alright, I'm gonna need you to die. Didn't I kill you in the seafront, whatever? Acha, acha, acha. Ah, ah. And you're dead. And you are. Uh, you really didn't stand much of a chance, did you? Nice. Give me that. Nice. I believe this was a dead end, so let's see if there's any goodies in here. Behind the three doors in a row. Thanks, Yokotara. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh god, really? This isn't even hard. This is just time wasting. Uh, alright, whatever. Then we do that. Uh, then we do this. Excellent. Job's done. Moving on. What was that? What did, what did that bothersome puzzle get me? A bunch of healing items. I guess that was kind of worth it, actually. Oh, look at how neat and orderly they were. Thanks, magical game designer in the sky. You're welcome. Alright, let's go. Nearly at the top floor. Nearly back up there. Kind of. I mean... From now on, I'm going to sleep outside with you. Why? I can't accept that you aren't allowed in the village. It's stupid. So you're staging a protest? Have fun! <laughs> Don't waste your time. But it oh, just goodness. feels wrong. Well, that's really nice of you, but you still don't have to stay out here with us. Emil. You got a Aww. super important mission. You can't sleep out in the rain. What if you catch a cold? Besides, I like camping with Kaine. Sometimes we sit around the fire and tell stories, or roast... Emil, that's enough. I've got a fucking image to maintain. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> They're so good. 
He's like, all right, da 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 da. I've only your older sister in private. Otherwise, I am the bitch queen, please. Uh, so good. Yeah, this is still here. Neat. Up here. And, uh, back around to... Where the fuck are we? Uh, this way, I think? Yeah, this way, sure. That way? Down here? Over here? Nope. Down there. Come on now. There. Nope. That. Oh, God. Nope. Down! We seem to be surrounded by a mob of helpless puppies. A little bit. Kick them aside. <laughs> yeah, kick the puppies! Do it! Also, why are they wearing things? They're they're wearing hats. Why are they wearing hats? That's a little weird, isn't it? Why why are the strange ghost monsters wearing hats? The two-handed sword beast lord. It is stronger and heavy. I don't know where Kainé and Emil went. I guess that this is these guys wearing armor as well. Is what this is. No, I was trying to stab. Vice. Okay. But Sarah, weapon magic XP rate up. Too bad we're not farming XP. No, Vice. I'm trying. Oh my god. <laughs> Trying to get off a thing and it's just nope. Hey, what the fuck's up here? Oh, that's a fast way back, okay. Nope. I swear to god, these fucking leathers. This is it intentional? You know it is. You know your guitar is still laughing. He always is. I'm gonna go for therapy to be like, Yo, Kotaro isn't in the room. He can't design around you. Martial arts, physical strength plus 15%. Nice. That thing's flying. Okay. Oh, it's dead. Eh. Uh, actually, speaking of, I should re-edit the martial arts. Hang on. Because they're currently... Yeah. So I can go Basil. And... Uh... Am I high? Uh, no, this is actually... Yeah, Basil. There you go. Oh, come on. I'm trying to get you to fall over so I can stab you. Damn it! Ah, damn it, it got up. I kill you at least. And you. And it missed. God damn it. Let's get stuck in the corner already. There. Alright. There we go. Job's done. Let's go. Back into the Hansel and Gretel room. See what's up with them. Speaking of Gretel. How the hell are you What's still alive? There's dozens of them. These are creatures of the darkness. Lure them to the light. Fair point. Pathetic to the end, I see. Aim for that statue. It's the leader. He 
you like? Kind of get screwed over here. I'll be honest with you. I ain't, I ain't having a good time. Really? I have no clue what's even happening anymore. They're just running at me and dying. Stop that! I guess I need to buy it like this. Whatever. And I blur that attack out, and I run up and slap you again. This is a weird fight. I feel like this isn't working properly, but maybe that's just me. I can just run up and slap you again. And I can't even charge it while this is happening. Huh. Weird. Oh, lock onto that. There. Oh, now you're attacking me, huh? Oh, are you shielding because you're not in the light? That'd be wild. No, you just stopped. Okay. Well, I'll just keep parrying you then. Up, 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 up. Acha. Yeah, this this ain't gonna end well for you, mate. I really don't know what you expected here. Alley oop. Nah, it's still at a health bar left. Told ya. <laughs> Fucking Beyblade up in here. Beyblade, Beyblade, let it rip. And then we start the parry wars. Hooray! Hacha! 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 I'm gonna start charging this. There we go. Just in time. Now you're dead. I even need more than one of these. Yep. Good. Hurry! Strike it down. Okay, uh try again and then maybe we can help I mean we got stabbed and we recovered, so there we go. There's an obscene amount of blood. We Sweeney Todd up in here.
Kanye, are you all right? Kanye! I fear there is little we can do for her. No! Kanye! What is happening? It's a shade half. That's not good. It's Kaine's shade. With no other choice, we must strike it down. Kaine, come back! Kaine. Mean to pin her down. Vice, now's not the time for that. Friday, please. Go the back fuck? Okay, I guess we'll keep this pattern up then. I'm hmm. That ain't working so hard. Yeah, so I've got to do these, like, bursty attacks there. And that again. Uh, she's not healing, so I guess that's just whatever. I don't know. Yeah, that's just like some weird shit she's doing. I, I don't know. Yeah, it's like she just blows the shit up, but I can just keep stun locking her. Like, as, you know, it's almost like she's not a boss. Stumbuck! Oi! What are you doing up there? Get down on there, Kaine. No jumping on the walls. Go to your room. Nearly got that. Nearly there. I got, I got, oh fuck. I got, save my magic, save my magic. One shot. Get this back. Oh, there it goes. Hey, there we go. Alright, now we kill Kaine. Oh dear. I couldn't hold it back. I can't be with 
We're always going to be together, Kaine. If you transform again, we'll just stop it again. As many times as it takes. I don't care how tough it is. We're gonna get you back. I like sleeping outside because I'm with you, Kaine. I'm able to ignore my appearance and keep going because of you. I'm weak and I'm sad and I'm lonely, but you make me strong. You're my friend and I need you. So don't you dare leave me. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Stop crying. And thanks. The game was auto progressing right. during the unmail thing, by the way. Oh, that happened. Mysterious stone fragment. And what is this? Hmm? It's me. It's got some kind of writing on it, but I don't know what it says. How remarkably useless of you. Well, let's go ask Popola. It's a cipher of some kind. Can you determine its meaning? I think this is the key to unlocking the Shadow Lord's castle. Here, take a look at this. I wrote down all the words I can understand. This fragment is called the Stone Guardian. Given that you found it in the Lost Shrine, the words must mean something. There are spaces here for four other fragments as well. Sacrifice, the Law of Robotics, the Memory Tree, Loyal Cerberus. The Law of Robotics probably refers to the Junk Heap, and the Memory Tree might be the Forest of Myth. But as for Sacrifice and Loyal Cerberus, I don't have a clue. Not a problem. Hmm? If we want to fill in the words, we just run around the world killing every big monster we find, right? Oh, splendid. By all means, let us undertake a murderous rampage. I don't know what you're on about, Vice. That sounds like fun. They're just shades. Besides, it's the only way to reach the Shadow Lord. It's a dangerous task. Yeah, well, Yona's in even more danger. But how can you even be sure that she's... Because she is! Right? <sighs> hmm. The Junk Heap and the Forest of Myth, yeah? I'm on my way. Please be careful. Oh, and listen, about Kaine and Emil. The villagers know how much they've sacrificed, and they're thankful. It's just, they're scared, you know? People can't change overnight. I'll hurry them along the best I can. But can you please give them a little more time? I'll try. All right. And we have our new goal. Find all the fragments of this stone tablet and piece together how to find a Shadow Lord from it. Oh wow, a merchant by the name of Accord, you say? We're heading for the junk heap. Popola said we might be able to find a key fragment in the junk heap. Perhaps we can find a clue at Two Brothers' weaponry. A merchant named Accord, I've never heard of such a thing. Yeah, we'll just leave that as is for now. There are those of you who immediately know why that's suspicious. Anyway. Oh, goodness. That's probably a good spot to call it for today on Nier. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Thank you to anyone who's been watching these VODs. And whether you're new to Nier or you've been uh, enjoying the rewatch. I just hope you've been having a good time. I certainly have. I've been meaning to play this game for a long time. And it's good to finally get to it together with y'all. In the meantime, I'm pretty sure Vicky Sanctus is still alive, so I'll be sending a raid that way. If you want to keep up with everything I'm doing, make sure to uh, follow on Twitch or on the YouTubes for the VODs, or on Discord for the community. 
may be a quiet one. Let's flesh raid Vicky Sanctus. And until next time, y'all take care.